Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how I stiffen up the rear end of our BMW E34s. As far as I'm aware, there is no aftermarket rear strut brace for an E34. There is a rear tear brace for an E34, but I've never seen anything else from the aftermarket. So what I tend to do is, is fit an OME tow bar to the rear of the E34 to stiffen up the rear end. So without further ado, let's fit a rear tow bar to our E34s. First, you'll need to find the two screw holes on either side of the boot floor. These may be covered with a plastic cap, which you will need to remove with a flat ended screwdriver. If these caps have been removed previously, you'll need a tool to get all the dirt out of the hole. There are also two more in the centre of the car at the back, which will need to be cleaned or caps removed. As you can see the top bar is on the floor now and you can see all the mounting points. There's two on each side, two at the bottom and four at the top. The top ones will need drilling out. Now it is time to remove the bumper carriers, make sure you have proper bumper carriers at hand because once fitted the tow bar you will not be able to use the standard bumper carriers. If you intend on using this as a proper tow bar with electrics you'll need to punch out the hole here. If you look on the other side, your right hand side, you'll see an outline that's the same as one on there. You'll just have to get a screwdriver and a hammer and punch it through. Now we have to take the inner boot trim off these clips are pretty simple there is an outside edge and an inside edge you need to get a little screwdriver push the inside in and the the brackets will pop out then all you have to do then is thread the electric through and into the boot if you was using this as a proper tow bar now you can offer up the tow bar to the body and bracket the sides up first then go on to the middle mounts please don't be worried if you don't fall on tow bars can be difficult to fit and get to fit now the bottom is secure you'll need to mark out where your mounting points meet the body and drill the mounting point out your kit should come with a flat um, piece of metal with two threaded bars on each one these go into the inside of your boot and you bolt it up from the outside once you have drilled an owl big enough to accept the two threaded screws this is the plate i was telling you about it's a bit hard to explain but that goes in from the inside and you bolt it from the outside And that's as much footage as I've got. My phone fell and my screen cracked. So I'm going to talk you through the rest. Basically, all you need to after that is fit your new bumper carriers, which is the same way as you took them off. And that's that then. You just put your bumper back on and it's done. I will not be using my tow bar to turn it for a minute. So I'm not going to mess with the electrics. I'm not an electrician. I know nothing about electrics. So when that comes, I'll just take that to a proper garage and get it done. But that's how you fit a tow bar to strengthen up the rear of your e34 and um, obviously as well if you use it as a proper tow bar you'll need to cut your bump up as well which i have done that before and i will be making a video of that probably but that's just how to fit a tow bar to strengthen up your e34 as a mod and you'd be best off taking it to an electrician to get the back wired up because there's a lot of electrics in E34s. Yeah, I know I'm 20 years old, but there's a lot of electrics and there's a lot what can go wrong. And I'd add to the summit of my car, 